When I was younger uh, in my career, I was always trying to find, seeking out a relationship with But one of the most um, important investments I believe that you can give back is to help uh, diverse leaders to grow. More than anything else is uh, I, I, I want to be that person that I wished I had found when I was a young man. What I am today, I realized how far I've come from where I started. And sometimes I don't realize that, which is kind of a self-appreciation. I also have learned how complex the field has become. We have, uh, we're entering new, new conversations around population health, value-based care, uh, outcome metrics. We are rich with people with the ability to deal with these forthcoming challenges. What we have talked about is for him to really realize his own potential. I have a mentee who's amazingly talented. I've encouraged him to be a sponge, to really soak up the complexity of the environment in which he exists. It's a huge personal satisfaction. Um, one, it is gratifying to see so many diverse leaders who are in the field, who have amazing potential uh, to take on future leadership roles in healthcare. For me, um, it's important that we do continue this legacy of having leadership reflect its community. And it's gratifying to me as, as we become more diverse as a nation that you start to see individuals in the leadership roles who had not been there before really become much more present and grounded in leading a vital organization on behalf of the community. How do we make sure that we are listening deeply keeping ourselves open to those communities, and then really understanding what their needs are and responding to those needs. I was presented this program from one of our DE&I leaders at um, Atrium Health, and that um, started me on kind of a journey of looking into what the program was about. And, um, you know, since I've come on, I've realized it was the right choice to, you know, kind of help and, and kind of make that commitment to my career development. I get to get access to a wealth of knowledge and information and leadership. So I think it gives me a great opportunity to see what diverse leaders can do. Learning how to be kind of that, that um, boundary spanning leader, you know, getting outside of pharmacy and working across uh, the lines to kind of help, um, you know, further the mission of my organization. I've made a lot of great contacts and um, friendships as a part of this program. Uh, you know, I've connected with a few other leaders within my own um, health system that I was unaware of, you know, that were participating in this program. And then working with Mark, uh, my mentor in this program, he's provided me a lot of great insight in terms of uh, leadership. He's been around, you know, in leadership roles for a long time. So just having that wealth of knowledge has helped me. One day I hope to be a mentor. Um, to some others, and I've been informally a mentor to certain people um, already, but just kind of helping pay it forward to future leaders. 